Okay, hello YouTube, Love Goes to Freeze, back for Resident Evil Blind Play for Chris's Story. And we made it to the laboratory in the last part, sweet! And I figured out what I have to put in first. Can I skip this bit? Apparently not. Come on already. Now, we got a sign in with this guy's name. Apparently the guy the guy's name is John. J O John Password Molly M O L E That should do it. Unless I spelled John wrong. A <laughs> nice typing animation. What? <laughs> Fuck. I spelled John wrong? I must have. Yeah, I had to, because... Not the map, the file. File. It says here in the researcher's letter, this is to the person... And according to um, this here, it says you can access the system uh, if you log in with my name. And his name is John. Yeah, I did spell his name right. And the name, and I, so what the fuck is wrong? Is that, was I that's not, the name doesn't say Ada, it says Ada. That's right, Ada. We, you don't see Ada in this game. I think you see her in Resident Evil 2. She becomes sort of an important character as the game progresses. Um. Yeah, the name is John. The password is your name. Wait, so the password is Ada? <coughs> Wait, then what the hell's up with the name? What's with Molly? You know something? I'm confused. Dot com. Let's try this again. Wait, what's this one? Oh, that's backspace. Now then, uh, J O H N John password. Let's try adding while well, doing it. Ada. It says the password is her is her name, and her name is Ada. Oh my god! Second floor. Accessing, accessing, accessing. Try enter password. Okay, this must be where I use Molly. M O L E. Certified! Woo! Yeah! Fist pump! Thumbs up! <laughs> that is so the thumbnail. Unlocked. But on a basement free. Can I unlock basement free from here? Accessing, accessing, accessing. Yeah! Fist pump! Thumbs up, baby! <laughs> Sweet. Okay, looks like we're done here. I've unlocked all the doors, and all I can do now is prog progress. Okay then, so floor two. Okay, so that door back up there is now unlocked. Alright then, I guess that's our next destination. 
Wait, that's right, a room was also unlocked here on the third floor. Uh... Where was that again? I don't know. We'll come across it. I just want to come across the save room first so I can switch my shotgun out for my handgun. Gonna go up the stairs. And we'll check out the room up here. <coughs> Either way, every room we go to allows us to progress a little bit further. Acid. I saw a desk. That tells me I need a small key. Too bad. I I'm afraid I haven't found a chest yet to go do 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 do. Okay, what's this? Security system. Uh, helicopter port. Elevator stops during emergencies. No, none, no one is allowed to use the passcode output machine, but the she, the she's researchers, top secret. Regarding the progress of the tyrant after use of the T virus, remaining, remaining document is unreadable. Okay. There's a panel. <laughs> Alrighty then. Oh, I need that. Hold on a second. Okay. You don't need to use that at the moment. Ah, fuck us. I need a save room. Fine. I'll have to come back then. We gotta go and locate a save room. Oh, I think I know where there's one. I remember. But can I get access to it? Yeah, the question is, can I get access to the room? I should be able to. I've unlocked all the doors, unless I need a key. Um, I can't drop anything, though. I'm going to have to waste two shotgun shells, actually. No, I'll just have to waste one. Whoa, that thing weird. Okay, we got space. Give me that key. I think I need that key to progress. I need to get to that save room. There's nowhere else I can go around here, so this key's got to get me what I need. Huh. Okay, give me this key right now. Will I take the lab key? Yes, I will. And this? It's an intercom, but it doesn't seem to be operative. Okay. Projector. Alright then. Okay, I think I'm done here. Cool. Oh, I thought he had me. Alrighty then. Ah, oh, son of a bitch.
You have used the lab key. Booyah! This key is useless. Yes, I shall discard it. Yes! Now we can go to the save room. Because the save room is just dead ahead of us. Right through this door, we just go forward to the room that's going to be right in front of us. That is the save room. I remember it. Whew! That means this part's going to be kind of short. Because I actually wanted to stop recording after the last part. Oh, for fuck's sake. Die. <sighs> oh, this beautiful music. That's a blue herb in here and a green herb. Okay, let's empty off some. Let's empty off my stuff. Don't need this. I'll replace it with my clips, baby. I'm gonna put my shotgun in here. Where is this? Because this is now very useful with all the enemies around being zombies. Slides. Slides! Duh. Uh, it's okay. This isn't really necessary. If memory serves me right, the slides, they just show you pictures of like the monsters and that. Probably shows you a picture of the tyrant as well, but shows you stuff like Neptune, the normal zombies, the hunters. Just a bit of information, so it's not really that important. So. There we go. Oh, I gotta love having all that ammo. And now my better editor is finally useful again. Now, let's collect the stuff that's around here. Ooh! Oh, more magnum rounds! Yes! Oh, there's something else up here. Ink ribbon! Love it! That means I got five more saves! Yes! Okay, let's grab our green herb. Yep. Uh, I think that's all of it besides that blue herb, but I don't really need that blue herb. So, I think I'm just going to ignore it. Now then. Shall I put my green herb in here? Oh, I love this, man. Guys, we are in the money! Hold on, I think I can combine these together. Perfect. Man, a lot of things are seriously going good for me. I'm loving this. 18 on the most powerful gun in the game. Man, that could probably last me a good fair while left of the game if I was bothered of using it. Which I'm not going to use it until it's, well, necessary. Which is not necessary until later. Oh my god, I am so prepared to c continue on. But luckily for me, I get to have a break. So, yeah, that will indeed do it for this part. We've done a lot of progress in the last four parts of this game. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed, and in the next recording session for me, might be the last recording session of the game, therefore being like the last few parts of the game, because Laboratory 3, we gotta deal with what's going on down there, and the remaining rooms around here, because if memory serves me right, I've gotta do some stuff in like the lab rooms and everything. And luckily... That room there, if memory serves me right, is the place we gotta go uh, at the end of the game. So, that's where we gotta go later. Basement floor 2 is finished, besides two green herbs that are still lying up there. I'm not, I might grab them. They could be useful. I mean, if I got those two and combine it with the green herb that's inside the uh, chest, I'll have two full heals. Two maximum hells. <sighs> so, yeah. We're pretty much done with the game. The game is almost over. I'd say maybe five stretching eight parts left of this game. If I'm quick enough, and 
they do it all right. So, yeah, about maybe five more parts, and I might do that in the next time I record this game. I might... Yeah, I think I will, actually. So, yeah, the next time you see this, see Resident Evil, know that I shall be... Whoops. I shall be done recording the game, and the remaining parts will be on their way. So, yeah, can you please put in the comment section below, uh, like, a hint on what I should do to continue on to get a good ending because I really would like to get a good ending ending after with Jill's ending I got a bad ending with Jill so yeah a good ending would be real nice and I'm hoping we run into Rebecca again we haven't seen her in a long time so yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed and I'll catch you all in my next recording session my final recording session of Resident Evil see ya boom boom